A new technique to remove cancerous skin cells without leaving a scar. How doctors are using imaging devices and laser technology in lieu of surgery. Skin cancer is the most common cancer. In the United States, the annual incidence of skin cancer uh, is greater than breast, colon, lung, and prostate combined per year. And of the skin cancers, the most common is basal cell skin cancer. Having grown up in Florida, having the sun exposure that I had, and I also have a family history of skin cancer, so I wasn't overly shocked that it was skin cancer, but I was very happy to find Dr. Markowitz and know that there is an, another option other than having to have these cut out every time. When she came to see me, I explained to her that I have uh, various non-invasive imaging devices and that when I combine these devices along with uh, some lasers, that we are able to start to shrink the basal cell and at times even clear it completely. It's different because they laser the skin cancer area versus having an incision and Mohs surgery to have the cancer cut and taken out which leaves a visible scar. And most people after that have to see a plastic surgeon. This is a game changer for some patients. They may not even approach treating their skin cancer because they're so intimidated by the surgery. And so this at least gives them an option to shrink the tumor and potentially also clear it. I sell real estate and, you know, looking good is important to me. So I wanted to avoid having a scar, especially on my face. So that's when I researched and found Dr. Markowitz. It's very appealing to know that I can treat the cancer and that it will be gone, but I won't have a scar on my face after this procedure.